number 7 is write an 8051 ALP to multiply two 8-bit numbers they are stored in 30H and 31H of internal memory and store the 16-bit result that is a product of 8 and 8 is 16-bit you have to store it in 32H and 33H of internal RAM locations so open the kill tool microvision 5 so this is the program the first line is comment so comment start with semicolon write an alp to multiply this option org 00 it indicates the beginning of your program move r not 30h we have to load the data stored in the 30h and 31 h so first you have to load r not with uh, immediate data of 30 so r not is having the address of that 30 and after that uh, in using uh, indirect addressing mode you can load the content of the address which is there in the R0, which is 30H, the content you can get it into the accumulator using move a comma at R0. So it will take at symbol means the content. The content of R0, R0 is having 30H. So content of 30H is actually copied to accumulator. After that, we have to get the data of 31H into the V register okay so first you have to do increment or not so increment or not means r not is initially loaded with 30h now it is incremented by one so now r not is actually 31 h so now if i take a move b comma at r not the r not is now 31 content of 31 is move to b see move b means b is the destination and is the source at r not is the source r not is already incremented so 31 h content is moved to b after that, mul ab, mul mul ab is continuous, no comma. So, mul ab means it is going to multiply accumulator content with b register content. So, 8 bit and 8 bit multiplied, if you are going to get 16 bit answer. So, that you have to store it in 32h and 33h. You can see the program statement store the 16 bit result in 32h and 33h. So, already after increment or not, now it is 31. Again, you have to do increment here before storing. You have to do increment R0 so that uh, R0 becomes 32H. After that, your answer will be after Malay B, your answer will be in uh, lower uh, 8 bit will be in uh, accumulator, upper 8 bit will be in uh, B register. So, from accumulator, you move to the destination, which is the address. So, move at R0, move at 32H, the content of accumulator. Accumulator content will be transferred to the or moved to the 32 h uh, again increment r not so r not now becomes 33 h again upper 8 bit uh, is present in b register now that you transfer to the uh, 33 location so let us uh, add this program so remove any old files so you refer a step by step tutorial how to create a project and all in my youtube channel it is there in the beginning so i'm going to add existing item so i will add uh, that uh, multiplication program now build target so this is a build target it is giving zero errors and zero warnings so next start debug Okay, now debug mode started the cursor actually pointing here okay pointer so we have to give some data in this location so open the memory window one so here you can see the memory window one and uh, you have to type here d colon 0x30 so d colon 0x30 means 30h uh, data memory so here right click and or double click and you can give any data for example i am giving 45h and uh, 23 any data you can give okay so uh, you can double click or you can do right click and modify data right click modify data you can give your 40 45h comma 23h which means hexadecimal so uh, this is also you can give or you can double click and you can change the value so now 45 will be taken to the accumulator so i am executing step by step step over see r not is loaded with 30h address it is taken to accumulator increment h r0 will be incremented by 1 and its content will be taken to 
B. Move B comma or not? See, A is 45, B is 23. Before execution of uh, Malay B. After Malay B, still it is not executed. Pointer is here. It is not executed. Once you do step over here, Malay B will take place. See, there is no A comma B. Malay B is continuous. Mal space A B. So now if I execute Malay B again, A and B contents will be modified. See, it's coming 6F and uh, 09. You can verify the answer using calculator. Go to hexadecimal mode. Uh, we multiplied 45H. First, clear the previous answer. 45 multiplied by 23. You can give any data. The 16-bit answer is 6F and 09. 6F is the lower byte. And that is present in uh, A accumulator. A you can see in the register. And B is actually having 09. It is upper uh, 8 bit per 16 bit. Okay. So now we can verify the answer in A and B, but uh, in the program, they specified you have to store the result in 32 and 33H. So we have to move that values to uh, consecutive next to consecutive location. So increment or not 32H from accumulator, you have to move that uh, 6F into that location. See, 6F came here. You can observe in the memory window and you can give one more increment h because if you don't do increment h 6 will be overwritten by other data so you have to after storing 6f into this 32h again you have to increment r not so that uh, r not is pointing to 33h and uh, the content of b register you have to move to this 33 application. So this is 09 scheme. So 45, 43, you observe in the memory window. 45 and 40, 23 is the data we had given, 8 bit data and 8 bit data. After that, the product is 96F. Product is 96F. We multiplied uh, those two numbers here. You can see 45, 25, 63. It should be in hexadecimal mode. So 6F is a lower uh, 68 bit data, 09 is the upper beta. So that is moved to next to consecutive location so similarly you can restart and you can give uh, different data in this location and you can verify the answer thank you